Here we go again. Yeah, this one scares <laughs> me. Actually, I should have done this one first. We kind of got it out of the way. But... Oh, it like scorched my taste bud so I couldn't taste it? Yeah, we just tried the... Um, um, the, the Zesty zest, ketchup. No, the, the tangy ketchup. Tangy ketchup, okay. And we kind of had a mixed reaction. Um, I'm a spice wimp. We, we both are. Yeah, but I'm a bigger spice wimp than you are. Um, but Doritos now also has another flavor. Mm-hmm. And it is... Uh, scary. Hot mustard. Scary! Yeah. It's very okay, so, scary. I asked you in the last video mm -hmm. what your thoughts were on Doritos. I like Doritos. Okay. How, where are you on mustard? Oh, mustard and I have a very complicated relationship. I only like it on certain things. We like did. my sausage biscuits. We did a video. Bologna. We did sandwich. a video on um, the Great Poupon. Yeah, the Great Poupon ice cream. And we both established that we're not mustard people. Yeah, we're just not mustard people. I mean, I'm... Maybe a little bit more than he is. Uh, but to me, it, a lot of things kind of get covered up by mustard. Mm -hmm. um, but it's just never been one of my favorites. The thing that... Um, the only time I really ever grab for the bottle of mustard is I like mustard on a bologna sandwich. Yeah. Thinly spread on a bologna sandwich. It gives it a little zest. Yeah. Um, but I've just never been a mustard Yeah. Now, you know, here's, here's the funny thing. I like, if I have a corn dog, dipping my corn dog in mustard. Yeah. But it yeah. all seems yeah. to be that same processed type meat, like mustard, sausage, hot And dogs. I'm really big on honey mustard. Yes, he does I like a good honey, honey mustard, mustard with his chicken tenders. Yeah. So anyway, let's go after this smell test. Just corn chips. Corn chips. Yeah. No mustardy. I mean, the other one definitely smelled mm -hmm. like ketchup. This one, not so much. This could be a sneak attack. Yeah, probably. Okay. Yeah. It's yellow. It's definitely right. different color. It's the right color. It's yellow. Yeah, it's picking up better on that than it is here. Good luck. See you on the other side. Hot mustard Doritos. Oh, oh, mmm. You like it? Mm, no, I do not. <laughs> oh boy, my tongue says ouchie, ouchie. You know what it is, don't you? What is it? Remember going to a Chinese restaurant and they had that little jar of the hot mustard sitting on the yeah, table? Yeah, yeah. That's it. Okay. You get, to, you get the vinegar, you get the mustard. It's a little sweet and very spicy. Mm. It, I will say this, it delivers what it promises. Yeah, but there's a flavor in it that I don't like. The mustard? Or the sweetness. I don't know. There's a little it's sweetness a little, it. I think it's the little sweetness. And you definitely have very pungent punch of vinegar in that. Yeah, a very heavy punch of vinegar Very in heavy, that. vinegary mustard. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not in love with that. No. So are you going to take this and put it on the, the table in the break room and go have at it? <laughs> I might. <laughs> you, you, know might. What, you know what happened? You remember the, um, the, the video we did on the um, Pepsi Peeps? Yes. Oh, yeah, did you finally go do I took the, the box. <laughs> I took that box, and I took it down to, um, I took it to work. I put it on the break room table and wrote on the top of it, help yourself. And they did. Oh, good. I went back for, um, I went back for lunch, and they were gone. Good. I'm glad they There was it. eight cans of that stuff, and they were gone. Ooh. And I kept walking back from lunch, and I kept seeing kids walking <laughs> You're, You're giving college kids free food. I mean, hey, college, discriminate. College kids live for free food. Um, okay, so like I said, Doritos, you guys actually did a excellent job delivering what your flavor wanted to, to give. 
That might be good with like a cheese dip. I'm wondering. Um, I'm gonna try that with a cheese dip. Um, uh, Ooh, what? crush it up and sprinkle it on top of a uh, pretzel, maybe. A pretzel? Yeah, maybe. I don't know. Yeah. Now I'm now because I'm still stuck on that. It's the the hot and spicy. Um, it it is. It tastes to me, and it's it's what it reminds me of. I'm sorry if this. Sounds um, cliche, but it does taste like the hot and spicy mustard that typically you can get at a Americanized Chinese restaurant. Yeah. Yeah. The good yeah. Chinese restaurant we like to go to that's authentic, you won't see that stuff, you won't on, see the that stuff on the table. But day. at the Americanized ones, you will. Both of these do not stand by themselves. Max, what you doing? Neither one of these stand by themselves. No, they need They're, something. They need something to go with them. I'm thinking a cheese dip. I'm going to try mm. a cheese dip with that. Mm -mm. Some kind of queso. Mm -mm. Um, mm -mm. Because it doesn't... It it, it, it no. needs something to complement it. Maybe a piece of cheese melted on top of it or something. No, no cheese. It, it, just, it, it needs something. Maybe a salsa? Maybe a salsa? We got we have a jar of salsa in the fridge, don't we? Yeah, we do. <laughs>